Spiro, as always in this building, you can feel the buzz, can't you? The electricity as we get ready to move. Interesting decision by Tom Izzo to start Xavier Booker today. Ball from long range. And Indiana likes the post up, but here's Renew down on the block. See if they throw a little double team at him, which they do. Three-pointer. It's Galloway. Well, he had missed coming into this game 13 consecutive three-point shots, so it's nice to see him get some rhythm early on with the inside-outside game for Indiana. Galloway was an excellent three-point shooter yeah. last year, 46%. And that's a good early sign for the Hoosiers. Three-pointer not even close from Booker. Some high-level basketball of late. Well, we've seen Hogarth go with the bounce, but really the only guy going towards the basket. Look at this bounce. And Baco, friendly bounce. Shot clock down to six. Walker against Cups. Hogarth from deep. And finally, he gets the Spartans their first points. That game, surprising that they won it. Here's Mbako, little sidestep. He's got so much offensive ability, and speaking of which, it's Ware on a stick back. Number 34, Booker, does he get a good box out on him? Kind of holds his ground a little bit, but doesn't push back. He just kind of puts himself into... And this Michigan State offense still struggling now. One of their first seven from the field. Hoosiers get it down the floor quickly. Inside, it's Renew. Well, Kola was a factor there, but late getting there to help out. But Renew is very, very active running the floor and getting into spots where he can contribute and really make things happen in a hurry. Boy, Walker, a little bit careless with it. It's a Spartan turnover. Look up, you get a layup. Galloway, second after this defensive effort. But watch the pass up ahead, and don't put it on the floor if you're close. Tom Izzo looking for a spark here. Trey Holloman is checking into the game. This is Hall. Tough spin over two, and the stick back there. Boy, beautifully done as Aikens. Ware calling for it. Has it on the box, steps middle, elevates. Boy, he is so good. The talent has been on full display. Boy, Aikens streaking to the cup, couldn't finish. Good luck. Where from deep? Topped on with his two of 13 from the field. Oh boy, wide open. And Bucko to handle with her offense. And not turning the ball over also, which is key. Holloman probing, looking for a seam inside, and he goes glass. Big shot for the Spartans. Feels Four like, 21. Feels like more than that, doesn't it? Just no consistency at all. Where catch and shoot, and he goes glass. <laughs> That's when you know you're in trouble right there. But he goes up, catches it at 15 feet away. Well, Booker looking at him and was fairly well de defended on that trip also. He's hit for at least 26 in two of his last three games, including Indiana's win at Minnesota on Wednesday night. Sissoko the catch underneath. My goodness. Come back. Not many easy buckets right here. Watch the regather, and now he bounces at once to get some. Really didn't score much at all against them. He scored 53 points. Boy, Walker hits a contested two deep in that corner. Mm. Oh, that's the end again, hitting the offensive glass. That is Mbako. That is just one heck of a rebound against two Michigan State players on the right side. And the finish was pretty good also, but the rebound was better. McDonald's High School All-American, IU's highest rated recruit since Romeo Langford. And boy, he is starting to put it together. Hogarth drives and kicks, sets the stage for Hall. And Michigan State now one of seven from deep. Renew with the leak out, and he lays it up and in. Here the last couple of years with Trace Jackson yes, Davis. Sure did. Holy smokes, what a play there by Ware. Open three, it's Hogard. As Michigan State punches back. There's another mm. deflection. Yeah, Michigan State defense has picked up a notch the last three times. Hogard across the floor to Walker. Now to Holloman. Hall on the box, turns and banks it down. Inside of two minutes left before the break. 32-21 Indiana. With the Hoosiers looking for a fourth straight win. And Bucko, splash. Boy, he knew 
that Hogard was forcing him to his left just a little bit. He sized them up and said, I'm not going left. I'm going straight up on you. Third three of the half for Mbako. There you go. Good drive. Here comes Hall. Flicks it up to the rim. And he's headed to the free throw line. Put it on the deck. Watch him go around the corner here and waits for the hit and then looks up and squares his shoulders towards the basket to finish it off. And Ware has taken all seven of their free throws so far in this half. Walker buries a transition three. A big lift for Tom Izzo's team. Hogarth gets a Kohler screen, hesitation maneuver into the paint, misses, it's stuck back inside by Hall. A beautiful hesitation there. Told you about what's at stake. Both of these two teams could finish anywhere between sixth and eighth in terms of the seeding in the conference tournament as Walker. Whichever team loses this game will be that eighth seed next week in the tournament oh. that begins in Minneapolis. <laughs> Khalil Ware. Nice. Offensive rebound Hall. Gets Cups, the smaller guy over there. Aikens another chance, and he sticks it from the corner. A lot of high screens coming at them. Aiken's gonna pull, and he buries it. First lead for Michigan State. Two game going scoreless in their win Wednesday against Northwestern. Boy, he has come back with a vengeance. Hall up the floor. Beautiful clean strip by Johnson underneath. Hogarth looking for some daylight. Walker around a screen. Splash! Boy, Tom Izzo found something over on the right side of that floor that he likes. He's been running down screens. Hall double nice team, work. good ball movement. There Hall guard. Yep, there he goes again. Into the paint. Boy, they are lighting it up with this offense. What a turnaround for the Spartans. Yeah, he may not be doing that great in terms of mounting up the points, but what he's doing is he's creating a lot of havoc. Boy, where that is a physical play going right into the chest. Michigan State deficit that they've turned into a five-point lead. Here's Renew, desperately need him to get going, and he gets a friendly bounce. He's got a great touch, that's for sure. Nice opportunity to steal there and deflection, but Johnson couldn't come down with it. Freshman making another start today, underneath to wear. Up top, he's just too strong once he gets on that buck. Defensive foul against Xavier Johnson. Inbound to Walker, he's had the green light, and he sticks another one deep in the corner. Tom Izzo wanted him to get on track. He's just not sure if he's going to be available here in the second half. Again, such an important piece for Mike Woodson in Indiana. Where, boy, tough shot, fading away. Going to reset with eight on the timer. Walker guarded by Leal, leans up, and he goes glass. Oh, that's impossible to guard just then. It's kind of like a hesitation shot. Look at this kid, my goodness. Right, now we're gonna open it up a little bit here. Spiro, they're going up and down a bit. Only source of offense for the Hoosiers in the second half, Jimmy. Nice and they pick. turn it over. Off the floor, boy, brilliant pass, and Hogard with the layup. So you have the deflection here, and Holloman just pitches it up ahead. Hogard finishing it off. All for free. Just turn on the TV and watch it. Yep, it's that easy. Pluto TV, stream now. Pay never. Walker left open, and he buries another three. And I know it's the Walker show right now, the way he's shooting the basketball, but I got to go back to Ho Hogard again in terms of the way he's pushing it in and dragging plenty of Indiana players into the paint to allow that kick out for Walker. Tyson Walker has been masterful for Michigan State. Oh, speaking of which, this kid Ware just keeps on coming. How do you stop that one, Spiro? <laughs> Again, if you've just joined us, no Trey Galloway in the second half for Mike Woodson and in Indiana. As Mbako snips it through from deep. If Indiana's going to post up continually. They double renew Johnson left open, and he hits. Retakes the lead. Days of the day for the Spartans. Johnson gets it back into the corner for Leal. Off balance. Boy, beautiful lob. Smart pass as he finds Ware. Here comes Walker sliding down. There they go. Double team comes out to Johnson. Back to Renew. Wow, look at the footwork. The shot. Got it. Just brilliant by Renew. Johnson, the jump pass underneath to Renew. Loves that jump pass, doesn't he? Backing down, Walker! Look up, 
Ahead of the pack, here comes Aiken. Oh. He puts it down. It's of effort in the backcourt. Watch Walker get it. Immediately looks up and he says, hey, this is a guard. He could breed everybody down the floor. As Indiana at one point was up 17 and we're up five at halftime. This is Renew taking contact here in Bloomington. Here's Ware, who's been magnificent, puts it up, and he's headed to the free throw line. Here just establishes. Now watch him here, and watch the people coming in. There's going to be a couple from every side, so he's surrounded, and he somehow gets a good, good no shot there by Hall. Walker losing Leal oh. inside, just masterful from Walker. Boy, was there a tricky dribble on his. And Indiana escapes with a one-point win.